Hello beautiful humans, Dr. Nikki Starr here coming to you live from Malibu. I was just on a beach walk and it was so wonderful and I had a really funny thing that happened yesterday and I thought I'm going to share it with everyone. <laughs> it's kind of like a secret, <laughs> but I'm going to tell the whole world my secret. So sometimes when I'm walking, where I live now in Malibu is closer to civilization. I used to live out by the county line and it was like so quiet and here I see people, I even see people I know, it's crazy. And I was walking down the beach yesterday and I saw a father and a son that I know and I actually was at their house for Christmas this year. So it's like crazy. And I once manifested the son where I like was walking on the beach and I like thought of him and I thought of his dog and then I went in the ocean and then I got out of the ocean and then he literally was running past me and I was like I just manifested you I was just thinking about you and so I said hi to them and I was like yeah you guys you kind of were in on my little secret I book my whole schedule around low tide and the sunset I am not available during low tide especially like when it's during the day. I will make that my lunch break, my break from clients. I won't schedule clients in that time because it's a very sacred and special time. And the same with sunset. That's for me sunset is like the universe's incredible entertainment. The way the colors in the sky change, like every moment for me is breathtaking. Like I literally could be taking pictures until I was blue in the face. Like for me, sunset time is like bliss. It is like magic. It is the most incredible time for me. And so I shared that with them. And the father goes, oh, you're going to find God during those times. And I was like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> How did you know? Exactly. When I am walking, so, you know, everyone has a different vocabulary of what they use, but I feel, and everyone who knows me knows that there is more to this reality than what we see, right? There is this whole energetic realm. There's this whole divine realm that we're all tapped into if we desire to be. And I feel I live my entire life in accordance with this desire, with this desire to commune with this blissful energy that we can call God and nature and we find it in nature. The elements are so strong there, just the energy of everything. And so every day during that time, during low tide when I'm walking the beach and at sunset, it is my time to commune with my highest self, with my guides, with the all that is, with nature. For me, that's the most beautiful time of day. And I feel that it's like stopping to smell the roses. It's that moment where there's something so magnificent and beautiful happening that it's like, take advantage, fully immerse yourself. And in nature, we always find it. That's why it's like, does anyone ever say like, oh, I wish I didn't go out to nature today? No, of course not. You're like, that was great. Sometimes you have to like force yourself to get out there. But the moment you do it, you're like, that was awesome. I'm so happy I went to nature. And that's the same for me with every beach walk. Sometimes it's windy. Like it gets, even my hair is like a little wild for my beach walk, you know? But it's worth it. It's still worth it. And I'm like getting, I get so tan and like I don't care, you know? Like the dermatologist version of me, you know, I was of an, some one lifetime ago I was planning to be a dermatologist. And that version of me would have been like, don't go out in high sun, wear sunblock. And now I'm like, whatever like give me that vitamin d that vitamin c you know and so i feel like it's priorities right and when we feel really good is when we're connected with our highest selves we're connected with the divine and that's why i do so many energy practices and all of my spiritual practices my rituals because it connects me but an easy way i get connected is, is when i go to nature especially when i'm at the beach there's you know, I really am truly living the beach life. And so I really invite you to spend that time communing with God, communing with your guides, communing with the universe in whatever form that is, in however you desire, because this is where the magic of life can literally flow through us. 
in those walks, I literally get, I, I received a new masterclass that I'm going to be hosting for women. I receive downloads for my work, for my day, things to do, who to call. All of that comes through in these moments and I'm not thinking about it. It's like I become this open conduit to receive divine guidance, to receive wisdom from my highest self. Sometimes when we're like so, so busy and we don't take these moments to slow down and commune with the all that is, we become like robots. I find in those slowing down moments, we really open up to something bigger than ourselves. And for me, I feel like that's the magic of life. And that's when we tap into bliss and pleasure and beauty and joy. We can also do that through our personal development work and our spiritual awakening. And as we find other ways to commune with ourselves, because our, you know, communing with our highest size, we're, selves, we're here to embody our highest, our highest selves. That's part of activating our ultimate potential. So I just wanted to come in and share that because I'm just feeling all the bliss vibes. So many bliss vibes <laughs> and so i love you and i thank you for being here i send you so much love i wish you a beautiful day and i'll see you soon bye for now